Welcome to the Dave Show. My name is Dave, and today I'm here to talk about this. Uh, actually, it's a really good cell phone. It's a budget cell phone. This is by TCL. This is their 30 SE model. It's a fairly new on the market. Now, the company didn't send me this product for review, but everything I say in this video is my own opinions. But they wanted me to show you uh, what comes with this and kind of how it works. And I got a chance to play with it for a couple days, so I'm going to tell you my experience with this cell phone. Okay, here's everything you're going to get in the package. You do get in instruction uh, manual and guide that's good because there's a lot of features to it uh, you're gonna get your phone I'll talk to you more details about that they do actually give you a screen protector included in the package so that's good and they're gonna include a case now this is a, a kind of a rubbery plastic case that will cover the back and the edges of the phone it doesn't cover the front because you got the front piece there uh, along with it so you got some pretty decent protection for your phone and you do get this little pin guide thing this is this is for the uh, sim tray on here when you want to put your uh, your sim card for your cell phone service in there um, that's what that's for and you're gonna get a charging cable with a little brick here a charging brick so you can plug that in now and it is USB-C plug in here at the bottom so it's interchangeable with a lot of things so um, that's all the bits and pieces you're going to get in with the package now i did uh, test out this phone for like i said a couple days i charged it up and everything i had it in the case i didn't put this piece on it uh, yet on there but let's talk about the phone itself okay so now this phone does not work with the certain providers it does say on the ad copy please look at and read very carefully what this uh, phone is good for and what it is not good for when it comes to your service so please pay attention to that it did work for my service i have t-mobile and i was able to take my cell phone uh, sim chip and put it into the phone itself um, there's uh, your, your volume controls and the on off button and then the other side is your little sim tray and that's the little hole that you poke in to get the sim tray the bottom has some speakers and the um uh the usb c connector to it there and then of course up here on the top is your some more microphone things um, and then in the back of it, it has a finger print reader here on the back um, it is set for mine and then you have cameras you have three different cameras and uh, according to the website this gives you like a 50 megapixel camera there's a close-up a long distance and a telephoto you know telephoto regular close-up camera options on there i did take some photos with this i'm going to talk about that in just a bit as well i just left the sticker on there um i'm going to go ahead and and turn this on now this is an android phone and it's powered by the google stuff and i have an android phone as well with google and to transfer all my stuff over it was really easy to do and it's got um all my apps on it you can see i have a ton of apps so all my apps from my other phone transferred over to here and it doesn't seem to be any problems at all um moving everything over in storage now you might have to set up some of the um, passwords and stuff because it's a new device so when you go into it if you have like banking you're gonna have to reset up your password so be, uh, be aware of that um, but it does a lot of stuff now first of all the, the things it doesn't do this one is not um, able to go to the 5g system so my 5g wi-fi at home it doesn't work but it does the 2.4 no problem and then the 5g uh, t-mobile cellular service it does not work with 5g cellular but it does do the 4g um and so forth and then the wi-fi in it as well but it has pretty much all the features and functions that you would expect in a smartphone um uh with everything i mean the guy that has a google for it um the um the photos the cameras i know that's important for a lot of people i did take some photos and some videos so let me show you those now Hey there, this is David. Welcome to It's the Dave Show. This is a test of the uh, uh, vlogging camera. This is the front camera of the new uh, phone I just got here. And this is a test of the video for the vlogging video. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop this. And we're going to turn this around and we're going to try the other camera. Okay, this is the uh, uh, look at the back cameras. And I'm doing a little vlogging, a little vertical vlogging on here. And of course, I would turn it sideways for actual videos for YouTube. This is like your tickety-tockety kind of thing. Anyways, just wanted to show you a test of uh, this. I'm taking my dog for a walk. There's, there's the dog. Hey, buddy, say hi. Hey, say hi, buddy. 
Yeah, hi, buddy. He's a good boy. Okay, there we go. So you can see the cameras are really good for the front facing camera as well as the back facing camera. Now, I'm not going to go over every single bell and whistle on this because it is on the website, on the information uh, here on Amazon. It shows you all of that stuff. But I know that it works. I, I use the GPS and it worked perfectly fine. No problems. I use the camera. I use the Wi-Fi. Um, I did the camera for photo and video, as you saw. Um, let's see, Wi-Fi to it. Um, I, I used the alarm clock, the calendar, uh, because it's all Google-driven. So it, it does just a ton of stuff. You have your swipe down menu, and you've got everything on here, your Bluetooth, airplane mode. You can do even record screen. You can cast on it. You can do hotspot on it, battery saver stuff. Um, so again, it's it's fully loaded with just about everything you will need for a phone at a budget price. So there you have it. A quick little look at this TCL cell phone. Um, again, double check to make sure it works on your system. But it actually is a pretty good little phone uh, for the price. It does almost everything my more much more expensive Android phone does, except for just a couple little things. So if you are looking for a good smartphone for yourself, for your family members, that kind of stuff, this one may be the right one for you.